What is an endoscopy? How to work? Types? Benefit? Best description? What is an endoscopy? An endoscope can be described as a long, thin flexible tube with light that can be carefully bent at any angle, with a camera at one end. The endoscope has become the most important tool in medicine serving to see inside body cavities. Endoscopes are usually inserted inside the body through openings such as the mouth and rectum, but they are typically inserted into the body through small incisions on the skin during keyhole surgery. How does an endoscope work? Basically a typical endoscope uses fiber optics, which allows for effective transmission of light. In this technique, fiber optics, light is transmitted through a flexible fiber, transparent, of glass known as an optical fiber. Optical fiber travels smoothly through curved paths, and allows light to travel through, making it one of the best systems for viewing places that are usually difficult to reach. Here, total internal reflection makes it possible for light to travel along the filaments, with the light rays hitting the filament walls at an angle. What is endoscopy procedure? Investigations, if a person is experiencing vomiting, abdominal pain, breathing disorders, stomach ulcers, difficulty swallowing, or gastrointestinal bleeding, for example, an endoscope may be used to find the cause. Treatment, an endoscope can directly treat the disease, for example, endoscopy is used to stain a bleeding vessel or remove a polyp. Sometimes, an endoscopy is combined with another procedure such as an ultrasound scan, how many types of endoscopy are there? Arthroscopy, dash used on affected joints. The tube is then inserted through a small cut close to the joint. Bronchoscopy, it is used to check for infection or growth in the lungs. The endoscopic tube will be inserted through an opening such as the mouth or nose. Cystoscopy, it is used to assess the damage done to the bladder. The scope will be inserted through the urethra. Enteroscopy, dash in this. It is used if there is a problem in the small intestine. The scope may be introduced through the mouth or anus for this. What is the use of endoscopy? Symptoms There are various digestive system disorders that should be investigated. These include gastrointestinal bleeding, vomiting, difficulty swallowing and abdominal pain. Endoscopy is also used for a biopsy or tissue sample is collected for later examination under a microscope. It helps to confirm or cancel certain conditions, and helps to understand their extent. It is used to detect cancer, inflammation, anemia and other GI disorders. Other important parts of endoscopy Water pipes, the pipes carry water which is used to wash the lens thereby maintaining a clear view. Operational channel, this is an opening on the device which is used to carry various accessories to the distillate end for the purposes of surgery. Risks and side effects of endoscopy 1. Extreme sedation Although sedation is not always necessary 2. Feeling bloated for a short time after the procedure 3. Mild cramping Benefits of endoscopy Safe, these processes have been around for almost a century, so they have been continuously refined and perfected to make them reliable for many processes. There are risks, but they are familiar and well managed. Quick, no extensive incision is made, there is no time to prepare the patient, give him anesthesia and carefully reach the desired location. In clinical cases endoscopy can be as short as 5 minutes or can last as long as an hour or two. If you want to know more about this article then you can visit our website www.newtechmedical.com.